April has been one fucking wild month behind the goddamn camera. And the reason why I say this is because there were so many technical things that I had to make sure were ready for the summertime and later on this year. I don't know if some of you caught that stream that I did, Dark Souls 3 with Shizzy and Pokame, but things went left real fucking quick. My PCs had a problem when it plays um, somewhat resource intensive games on full screen or whatever, it starts to slow down XSplit. The game runs perfectly fine on its own, but the broadcaster, and we thought it was just exploit, but it turned out to be OBS as well, gets fucked up. Going forward with not being able to record PC games, and then some of you might remember my 3DS fucked up on me a few weeks ago as well, it was just a lot of fucking pressure on me to try to get these things working well, especially considering that big games are coming off of these consoles in the very near future, especially after E3 and stuff, there was no way that I could move forward with all these problems. So I took all of April to pretty much kind of zone in on exactly what the problems were and figure them out, and this is a lot of troubleshooting, trial and error, and finally, I managed to pretty much fix all of these things. So I can record from every single medium now. PC, I can record from. I knew I could record Undertale as well, but Undertale wasn't really intensive on the PC, but I figured out all this stuff now because if you have things on full screen, then basically they, re they use more resources on the broadcaster, but it's a little bit weird of a process, I know. Just understand from this point forward that everything will be able to be recorded on this channel and there won't be any more problems in regards to, oh, we can't do this or we can't do that because that a good setup ain't fucking right. And I like, no, no, no. We took all month to figure that shit out. And I'm glad I did this now because trying to do it in the middle of the fucking summertime with all the fucking hype would have been horrible. The 3DS capture card breaking on me was really sucky and I couldn't even upload the stream because I fucking got depressed whenever I watched that thing. But I think we may have found a solution, my boys. And you're going to like this one. Let's go to the web browser real quick. Look at that. So now you're saying, wait a minute, Etika, you have your capture card working? You got Fire Emblem on the goddamn screen? What's going on here? Look, niggas. Look, niggas. It's wireless. It's wireless, my boy. It's wireless. Look at that. Now, of course, when I play this on Xbox, of course, the, the screen will be bigger in my streams and whatnot. But just showing you raw, everything's good here, man. And by the way, you see that nice Kamui theme right there? Look at this, my boys. Got everything... Working good, we got that Smash Brothers on deck, all wireless, man. I know you don't hear audio, it's because I don't have the aux cable in, but I just didn't feel like putting it in there. You might be wondering to yourself, Etika, how are you performing this magic? There's no wires, there's nothing there, and there's no connections. My boys, even though it took me a little while, I spent this month hacking my 3DS. In fact, it was such an intensive process, I bricked my silver Monster Hunter 3DS in the process. That shit is done. It doesn't work anymore. I try to turn it on and it just gives me an error. Isn't that crazy? It's fucking insane. But I managed to hack my 3DS. Of course, not on my own. I have to give a huge shout out to my boy, Alex Stefanis. That man walked me through. And I know a lot of you might have heard of this already. The fact that people can capture footage wirelessly from their 3DS using a certain hack. And we spent the last week working on that shit. Seven days, my man. And it was so much more of an intense process than I can explain to you guys right now. It required an insane amount of steps to be able to get this thing working. We had to bring the 3DS back to one of its oldest firmwares, 2.1, to acquire something that it had back then and then to bring it back to now and then be, it was so insane of a process, but I'm glad that Alex walked me through this shit because now we don't have a problem with recording anything on this channel. Android, we got it. PC, we got it. Consoles, we got it. 3DS, we got it. It's all in tow, my man. This means that we can now focus our attention on exactly where it needs to be, the hype, the news, the reactions, the the announcements and of course E3 is right on the horizon my boy you know some shit is going to be revealed there I know maybe I should have made a video telling you guys about what I was doing before I did it but I kind of just get lost in this stuff and in order for me to make sure that my workflow wouldn't be fucked up when summertime comes around when I have to really be there to cover these big topics I had to take time to fix these problems now can you imagine all this stuff with E3 going down and your boy can't record his fucking PC like it was so stupid so I mean with that out of the way, we are adequately prepared. And you know, not too much crazy big time shit happened this month, aside from a couple of um, you know somewhat noticeable gaming announcements like the PS4 getting a new version and a couple of game stuff too, like, like new announcements of certain games. I mean, Titanfall 2, that looks great, but nothing really major in terms of like ball busting. And you know, of course, we can address the nut sex sandwich later, but I mean, nothing that's too 
groundbreaking you know all that's being saved for later on this year may june i know a lot of you are still going to fucking shit on me i mean that's just the natural way that's the internet though that's why we're here i mean the, the only purpose that the internet has is porn and shitting on people so i mean with that in mind i just want you guys to know exactly where this channel is going from now and i will talk to you in the next video and of course if you think there's anything that will tickle my nutsack um at least for the remaining remaining amount of time that i have it i want you to send it to me on motherfucking twitter but at least with all these recording problems and setup issues out of the way we're gonna be ready for the rest of the year we're we're gonna be ready for E3, we're gonna be ready for the hype, we're gonna be ready for the NX, we're gonna be ready for everything, my boy. So, I mean, yo, let's fucking move forward. I'll talk to you dudes in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.